I'll be honest, I don't remember the name of this map off the top of my head, but I did ask them to start. Steel and rats they're going. This is not Steel Rats. This is okay. not a map we have played. Alright, so Connor with a good start. Well, that match hasn't started yet. <laughs> yeah, know, okay. <laughs> Alright. Cameron Ooh. immediately grabbing the Mega Health. That's going to be really big. But Connor's got a weapon. Connor's got the rocket launcher, it seems. He's stacking up. He does not have the rocket launcher, but he's stacking up on weapons. There we go. Now both players with the rocket launcher. It's curious to see where this goes. Cameron is seems or Roki and eh, fuck NGC yeah. is, seems to get what he has wanted. So that's definitely a really strong start. Oh, yeah, wow. good rocket. That's good, right, yeah. good rocket. Oh, and the red armor's right there. That's just a this, chef's kiss. Yeah, this could be a, a very quick snowball. We'll see how it plays out. Don't count out Connor just yeah, yet. Yeah, Connor has got some pretty good accuracy under the table, you know, like some some stuff I wasn't really expecting seeing from him. <laughs> but NGC has just got the most phenomenal routing right now. Like, talking yeah, like Gordon Ramsay, this is ridiculous. <laughs> right. Get everything he possibly could need. Oh. Uh, looks like they just missed each other potentially. Yeah, they did just miss each other, but honestly, I kind of, I kind of understand Cameron's perspective. His perspective, and from what I know from his game plan, I know that basically his ideology is he's going to try and score as much as he can on pickups, and he's yeah. afraid he's not going to be able to win situations like the one he just won. So without those, I see very careful so it, player. So his goal is to time out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's see. I yeah, he just got the he just got the drop on Connor, but a terrible rocket jump is gonna prevent yeah, him from catching missed, up like that. Missed that one, but it looks like Connor's running away. He understands the situation. Oh, he flanks him. Coming back around. Your rocket jumping oh, through. Yeah. Oh yeah. Holy yeah. Uh, not able to keep That's uh rope. page number one on the textbook. Someone didn't do their homework. <laughs> Uh oh, Connor taking a little bit of damage from the toxic goo. From the toxic goo goo. He's stuck in that for a little bit too long. Now but he's okay. He had the overheal, so it's doing a little shimmy over. to catch up and flank Cameron. Getting some splash good sh good splash, good shots. No direct hits from either player. Uh -oh. oh. Uh oh. Yeah, that's it. That's quite a rocket. But that did chip away at quite literally all of the armor he had. So he's oh, yeah. now going to have to rebuild for the next fight. Connor making Connor sure that... Uh, I know that Connor's winning some of these fights and interactions when they both got a rocket launcher. Mm. But Cameron is just so good at routing that he's yeah. preventing a lot of other play. He even has a railgun in his back pocket too. That's, that's pretty nice. I will tell you, I do know that no one is using audio cues because even watching NGC's screen, mm -hmm. I was able to hear the lightning gun from around the corner. Yep. These audio cues are going to make such a difference whenever the people start paying attention. That was such a good rocket too, yeah. right on the feet, get that max splash damage. And you could hear the machine gun from uh, Connor mashing to try and spawn faster, ignoring mm -hmm. it entirely to go for the mega health. Really smart, really good routing. Uh oh. Ignoring, right. just ignore that, because he'll come through for you. Yeah. Yeah, not looking great for Connor right now. Yeah, Connor playing very predictably, just allowing Cameron to steamroll him yeah. in the way that he likes to play. Mm -hmm. I noticed earlier too, uh, Cam was trying to camp some of those corners of the rockets, and Connor was not respecting it nearly enough. It seemed like. Yeah, and that's what you have to do. You've got to give those, you've got to give projectiles, especially the strong splash damage projectiles like the rocket launcher, you've got to give them a good amount of respect. You can't just, like, if someone's got a game plan, you can't really, like, try and face force your way into it. Otherwise, you're going to get run yeah. over. For sure. Man. Yeah. Rocket he jumping off of armor, them. But it's, it's not nearly enough. He was able to pick up the, oh, Connor got the red armor this time. But he's going for the health bonuses instead and the yellow armor just to keep his health up. See, that's the thing. These pickups are just so big. Like, yeah. <laughs> I don't know. Connor, he was not waiting for the mega health. I believe that's where the mega health. Great spawns. rockets from Connor, chipping away at all those pickups. Who cares? Who cares what pickups he had? Yeah, just eating through every. Oh, come Connor on, said, "My mega health." Hey, this match isn't over. Three minutes on the clock, though. 
NGC might resort to his uh, Joseph Joestar secret technique and just start running away for the rest of the match. Oh, here it is. Just uh, went over to him and he's just running like a little bitch. <laughs> the bold strategy. We'll see if it pays off. By nice. bold, I mean not at all. Connor has a few more weapon pickups right now, but nothing substantial. Yeah, nothing crazy. He's got... He's got a rocket launcher. Rockets, though, yeah, he does got the rockets. Health, overheal. Cam is continuing to run away and avoid any potential interactions. Oh, I hear them. Yep, they're they're close to each other. Cam's looking around. He's waiting for him yeah. to go around the corner. Oh man. Man, look at these pickups from Connor though. Connor is just destroying as far as like the item pickups go. Did you see that delayed reaction from uh, Cam? I, I don't know if he was distracted by something. I don't know. Connor came around the corner and he was guns blazing. Connor could, could win this interaction. He, he, he did! Wow. He did! Rocket Launcher seems to be a saving grace, able to eat through all of that extra pickup. Cam does go for the red armor again, he gets it. Connor is playing it really slow. Uh, I do know that as far as a lot of the players go, Connor's movement isn't exactly the crispiest. Yeah. Yeah, I, I would and say it's... Cam's doesn't look incredible, but it, it's it gets the job done for sure. Probably oh yeah, better than mine, but uh, we'll, we'll see. We'll see. Another rocket launcher pickup with Cam. Connor still does have a bit of armor though. Uh, I don't know if those rockets will just eat through it real quickly. Good rockets bouncing him through the oh. teleporter, waiting to camp out the teleporter. Yeah, he knew. Yeah, he wow. knew, and he still fell Good for awareness. it. Good awareness. Good awareness. Yeah, great awareness from uh, Connor to sit there and wait, because he knew that Cameron's dumbass was going to run through there anyway. <laughs> okay, now he has... Oh, he's, okay, there he goes. He got the rocket yeah. launcher pickup. See, this is so unfortunate, launcher, right? Because Connor has started to have the biggest pullback of all time, but the timer is running out. It doesn't okay. matter. He still, has, he still has a couple more games, potentially. Yeah, we'll he's, got, he's got game two, but right now... I feel like he's adapted quite a bit to Cameron's playstyle, at least mm. on this map. The problem is that like it took him a while to learn how to route this map out. I'm a little nervous for game two, because I think he's gonna have a lot of similar problems. Yeah, potentially. Cam's natural uh, experience with with Quake uh, leads him to a, a deeper understanding of some of these maps quicker as well. I just think that honestly, more of it comes from the fact that Cameron is a more meticulous player in most games. He's just, nice yeah, game. see, like, look at this. This is exactly what I was talking about. He's just going to wait on those pickups. He's just going to play mm -hmm. slow because he knows, you know, 17 seconds. There's no way in hell. Yeah. Like, there's just, <laughs> there's just no way in hell that Connor can pull this back. He may be able to get an extra frag, but, like, what's it really going to accomplish? He's going to be able to go to sleep at night. That's what game two is for. Yep. You can run it back. Practicing a little bit with a rocket jump, but it seems like in the goop he can't get uh, any uh, mobility from that. For sure. Now, I don't know what map they're planning on going to for game two. Of these three, I think the smartest map to choose for both of them would be the edge. Mainly because the edge is a map they both have experience on to a decent degree. True. True. And I did see that uh, NGC did vote for the edge, and that is smart. I, like, I don't know if... Connor was about that pick because he didn't vote at all, but I will yeah. say I do fully understand and agree with going to this map. For sure. Could, it, we did uh, have a bit of pregame on this one, so I think uh, I think for both players it'll be familiar enough uh, to <laughs> Cam having a bit of fun. Um, let's see, man, did you notice I mean, just like you were saying, on the post-match screen you just saw those pickups that Cam had. It, it oh was yeah, it was overwhelmingly uh, just clear awareness of the map and the, and the routing. Except for that teleporter interaction, that was that was pretty pretty good by Connor. Now I will say, Cameron did notice him earlier. Like he saw Connor down the mm -hmm. hall. I'm wondering okay. what the thought process was behind running in right now, especially when he knows that he's not very accurate with a machine gun. Well, it ended up looking. It ended up in his favor entirely. He just walked right past him and got everything he wanted with relative ease. Look at these pickups. He grabbed everything on this map with no problem. He's now camping. Yeah, 
What if you're Connor? What do you do here? Yeah. Well, the answer is one. die. Uh, let's see here. Yeah, running straight for the mega health, oh, missing man. the rocket jump, but getting the second one. Yeah. Connor, uh, taking the executive decision to leave and try and grab the shotgun. It's far. I, mm, I, I think that's a great decision to go down that hallway. Though. I don't think so either. Cornering himself and it clearly it didn't work out. Cornering yourself like that is never going to lead to anything but turmoil. It's oh, just so sad. He, what was he looking for there? Well, <laughs> he's getting the grenade launcher. <laughs> okay, we'll see if Connor can make it work. Uh, NGC grabbing the uh, NGC grabbed the red armor as well as a lot of armor shards. So right now his armor values are super high. Yeah, just yeah. buy bitch. Shot that guy off the cliff. Don't even bother fighting him. Go back to picking stuff up. Connor could have. Nope, oh, he's gonna. Good job. Good yeah, job. grab the mega health from under uh, NGC's nose. Smart. NGC is almost out of ammo. Connor could mm -hmm. win this fight on that interaction alone. Oh, oh but like, yeah, you face you've got to face that. There. Yeah. He had a bit of an advantage, and clearly Cam was a little bit spooked, judging by his careful nature. The rocket launcher did just get picked up, which means that mm -hmm. Connor was near nearby. Cameron recognizes this, but Connor didn't have the rocket launcher out. Did he not pick yeah. it up? I I thought he still had a few uh, few rounds left at the, at the very least. Maybe I did as well. Connor looking at the railgun spot, contemplating picking it up, but siding against it, and then getting oh. paying immensely for it. Yeah, why, why would you... He ran away a lot of other times. Why would he stay there? I don't know. Maybe I don't know. I have to fight sometime. I might as well try to chip away. Yeah, the decision-making the decision making here doesn't make a ton of sense to me. But, like, you know what? Yeah. Who am I to judge? I don't know. I'm not in his head. Plus, I'm not competing for 50 bucks. I'm just the guy bitching at him on the microphone. <laughs> True. Okay, Connor's... Getting some pickups. Pick fighting his time. Switching well, back so to Cam. yeah, switching back to the NGC cam. He's just he's just going crazy with all the pickups. He's this is yeah. very very one sided. This whole this whole match has been. It's not yeah. out of Connor's hands. It's but oh no, not looking good, folks. Oh, right, trying to run away, but that rocket that rocket was disgusting. His movement not the crispiest, couldn't get out of there in time. Okay, smart, trying to go to his potential best uh, way to gain advantage with the rocket launcher. It's like I'm, I don't think this is just out of Connor's hands yet, especially with the pickups he has, but. Okay, here's him, maybe? Is he gonna go after him? Uh, I think he retreated, because he was right okay. behind him. Yeah. Oh my, <laughs> completely unnecessary, but, but why not? Why not take it out of uh, Connor's hands? Go ahead and get the red armor. Gonna get the mega oh. health. Okay, just gonna keep stepping. Wow, look, look at that health bar. <laughs> oh my goodness. That is unfair. Yeah. Oh uh, no. When you've got accuracy like that, and you're like stacked up like a tank, this is just a little unfortunate. Mm -hmm. Again, Connor, not done yet. We still got three minutes to turn this around. Don't, don't even bother. You saw him go he the other way. Tie it up. He could tie it up. He could take us to a, a game three, but I'm not super confident in that right now. But we'll see. We'll see. Don't count him out just yet. Hopefully, he can try to keep things a little competitive. We'll see. Yeah, my left ear loves where Cameron is right now. <laughs> I just can't tell. <laughs> Oh, he's above him. No, Connor, what are you doing? You can't. He's above you. Um, he's yeah. ab I don't know if it's just like... Oh, maybe he was going for the roundabout. He was coming for the back because he knew how to get in that door. Yeah, I'm almost feeling like I have a little bit of an unfair advantage here with these headphones you got me. Uh, shout out to... Uh, <laughs> wait, are we doing sponsors? No, we're not. <laughs> I don't even know what brand these the, uh, are, but... Yeah, you're Sounds using my. Important. Oh yeah, That's, those are the headphones I used for a long time. So I got this wire, these wireless ones that that Cloud X headset. It's the best shit on the market. This shit's awesome. Yeah, with with less than three minutes now, it, it's it's looking pretty dire. Do they hear each other? 
Okay, Cam's looking around like, where the hell is he? Oh, um, they finally like, oh, spotted each other. Oh, oh, come on, Connor. Come on. Oh, wow. Picking up the red armor just for two armor points. Just salt in the wound right now would be if uh, NGC gets another frag. Yeah. Grab the mega health just so that Connor can't have it. Just no, no chance here. Unless Cam just decides he can't sit, hit the side of a barn wall, but he hit the side <laughs> of the barn wall and he got the kill. That was a lot of damage he took there. That interaction was <laughs> yeah, a yeah, little Cam, embarrassing. Cam was a bit less careful. Uh, I think Connor would have had yeah, that Yeah, Connor but... would have got the drop on him. Both players are playing really well. It's just NGC's routing is just fantastic. Mm -hmm. Like mm -hmm. keeping keeping up from the trend of last game. If you get every pickup, it's like wow. What are you gonna do? Connor going for the a little bit of disrespect, maybe. Oh, he couldn't even see him. <laughs> that was ridiculous. Man. I don't think the HMG is gonna be enough, but well, maybe the rockets will. We that was unnecessary. Those pickups are just ridiculous. Yeah. Just ridiculous. <laughs> you know, we got a minute left on the clock. Let's take a look. We got ten red armor pickups, nine yellow armor pickups, nine green armor pickups, and eight mega health pickups. Good lord. And there's call another one. call that ten and call that nine. That is just obscene, everyone. That is, <laughs> it is a, that is an unfair imbalance in the amount of pickups. Yeah. So what's Connor gonna do? Is he gonna try to maybe get a little bit of one-on-one -on -one close quarters firefight experience, or is he just gonna wait it out until his demise? Um, it's right now. It's looking like he's going in. He heard. He's getting him, shooting him oh, with a. Oh, oh man. That's that's rough, folks. That's you hate to see it. <laughs> well, quite the one-sided match here, but that is going to be 2-0 for NGC over Connor, his first opponent and my main co-caster here. Wow. Am I next up?